Yo, what is up guys? My name is Voss, and today we will be doing a free pro gameplay, and I'm going to be using the T27. Also remember that this is a live comment... What? Um, this is a live commentary. So, stuttering, you know, uh, loss of attention, things like that. That is just me being a terrible multitasker. Anyways, that's me being a terrible player. Guys, recently I got a message on YouTube um, in my analytics that the subscriber count for YouTube was messed up. That's that's freaking pathetic. Uh, and you know, <laughs> oh. I don't know if that applied to me or not. But I went ahead, kind of looked around, and I have a live subscriber account on my phone. Now you know that uh, subscribers on YouTube can be very, very delayed and such. So I have that on my phone to kind of get a better idea of where I'm standing right now. Well, it hasn't gone over 170 in, you know, a couple weeks. Now, that may just be I'm not gaining a lot of subscribers right now. But I'm kind of interested to see what happens. It said it was through the 17th through the 19th. So, super interested to see what happens after that. Hopefully it will be a... Oh, he got one tap again. Man, I'm getting a lot of one taps. I don't know. Really interested to see. Anyways, with Torque, I don't know. Clan's in a weird spot right now. Um, it's, again, going you know, extremely well. No issues with the clan. Um, we uh we did lose a few players recently. Um, not really important players, but you know they're they're kind of inactive anyways. But you know they, they were nice people to have in the clan. And you know we lost an opportunity to uh to make it not a merge, but a uh, uh, I guess I guess you could say a merge. And uh, you know th those things happen. Uh, you got you got up days and down days with the clans. I mean that's just how it goes. You can't let them get. You can't let it discourage you. But uh, you know, we're looking forward. We're maybe hoping to uh to oh, oh that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> My opinion, sorry man. I really, really hope to make some improvements as far as spreading to other games. Um, we really have a good a good you know a good foothold in Warface right now, and you know I would really like to see the clan expand to games such as CS:GO and R6. No, I know a lot of people talk about this, and I know a lot of people have dreams of this that make clans. And you know, we're actually trying to. This is just super annoying. I hate snipers. They're so gay. They're so freaking stupid, man. Um, the scout should have never been added. So we're really trying to make this happen with Torque, and what we're trying to do it responsibly and slowly. We're trying to make sure we have the correct management for these areas. So if you happen to be watching this video. And you maybe are a CSGO, why do two people need that same spot? You maybe happen to be a CSGO player, an R6 player that is, um, that is, you know, well versed in the game. You know, keep, keep on, uh, keep on watching the channel and keep on, uh, keeping up with us. And, you know, we may have a video out soon talking about that whole deal. So, very excited for that, those improvements. That's awkward. Um, Look into that. You know, we're also trying to be clan recruitments. Um, as I said, we're we're kind of in a weird spot. We really don't have anybody to recruit. We're just kind of trying to build off of our um, people that we know um, our options. I like I actually come with a F447. Good job, friend. So it's just hard, and we're we we do we do use the uh, the clan recruitment page or torclan.com. Um, we use that once in a while, but not as much as we used to. For the sake that it's just hard to uh, to do that consistently. Also, um, if you could be bothered to uh, to give me some responses on vlogs, that would be nice. Um, I got a lot of people that say they're nice. You, they enjoy them. They're different. And you know, I, I kind of want to, 
you know, I kind of want to direct this response, you know, maybe give a few comments if you can uh, spare the time. I didn't say, I didn't see him. Um, you know, and let, let, let me know straight up, you know, uh, vlogs are nice, vlogs are cringy, vlogs are worth it, vlogs are not. That would be highly appreciated. Can't get a better idea because honestly, um, that was embarrassing. I am, um, you could say new to YouTube. Um, I ran a channel before, but I really didn't get all the views, so I really don't know how to uh, how to make my content relevant to my viewers. And as you know, for me, for me, and you know, for example, Fade, um, we both make content for Warface, and that's a super big nerf for you know trying to gain subscribers because nobody watches Warface videos. You know, who cares about Warface right now? And hopefully my account can change that. And hopefully they can make that into something that would be worth watching and that we can get more viewers and stuff like that. Anyways, I'm 100% open to, to criticism. Okay. Um, criticism, you know, uh, ideas, you know, I'm not, I'm not, uh, shut up to that kind of stuff. And also, if you guys enjoy these free fall gameplays, these can be shelled out every day, by the way. Um, I can, you know, make these nearly, I think, I think every day, but most likely. But, um... The T-27 is a beautiful gun. That was, that was nice. Um, T-27 is a beautiful gun. Uh, I like this gun a lot back in... 2014, 2015, it was my go-to rifle because it was the first gun I unlocked and it was really the supreme master of guns. I mean, it was like the assault rifles. The R16 was not around. The R16 has not been around forever. It, guys are, are very fortunate to uh, to have the R16 in this game because the R16 makes the game so much easier. And, you know, back in the day, in comparison, that guy's so weird. It was like movement. You know, the T27 was a god-tier rifle, but, you know, and it's also the T27 looks like a god tier rifle right now, maybe because I'm using it. Um, but it's not that nearly as easy in a rifle as the R16. It has a lot of it has a lot of radical bounce. Um, you know, if I'm not controlling the recoil, you know that that's kind of a weird recoil, and you can see that the actual dot bounces a lot. It's not just static like the R16, so um, it can be more difficult. But I don't know. This this gun has been my preference for a while, and I will always love this gun. And recently, I've just been I can't get enough of it. That's beautiful. But I'm trying to get used to it. I never really was really good with the R16. Um, never really. I never really got into it. Um, you know, uh, a lot a lot of the big players in Warface, they all you know they all got on they all clicked with it and they you know enjoyed using it. It was like oh you know, the best gun ever. I just never enjoyed it. Like I always thought it was an awkward rifle. I was just I, I never could use it basically. Like to, like how sad to say, I really could not use the weapon. Like I couldn't control the recoil. I couldn't move with it. I couldn't be you know consistent. And you know uh, the the gun is insanely easy. Like I said, the gun is insanely easy. It's just not my preference of gun. You know, I, I got I got a, I got as good with the R16 as I had I was with the T27. Um, I did get to that point, but I still did not enjoy while I used it. So now I'm just gonna be farming as of right now. I'm gonna be farming the T27 to try to be able to compete with people that use the R16. I'm bad. 29 seconds to get this kill. He's gonna be camping right there. <laughs> I'm bad. But, um. I don't know, I guess. I'm also really excited to see what they're gonna do with Warface, you know? Like, this guy knows where I am. Where? Hi, buddy? Oh, that's unfortunate. I'm excited to see what they're gonna do with Warface, and, uh, I'm really anticipating some, uh, some better changes, you know, see what they can pull off. Now, I thought I had a way, and I thought I found a way to, to be able to change your name, and it turns out I was incorrect. So I was going to make a video on that, and I may be able to find a different way, 
but I believe there is a way somehow through some ticket system that you can. But um, if I ever find anything else about that, I'll let you guys know. But anyways, I appreciate you guys watching. Thank you guys so much, and I'll see you guys in the next video.